Good morning. Hey, this is Tom from Steel Yard Pickers. How you doing this morning? Uh, I'm just sitting there on the deck on my humble abode. Just um, thought I'd talk to you today about picking. You know, picking is a lot of people, what a lot of people think of picking is um, when you go to the someplace and go through a bunch of junk and maybe find something worth a little bit of value. And I guess that's one way to pick. But I'd like to talk to you today a little bit about something I like to call shop picking. Now, my wife, she likes to shop a lot, so I kind of tag along and go with her. And when she's out doing her thing, I kind of walk around the stores a little bit and I uh, look for different things that maybe I could reuse or um, use in a different way as kind of something, I don't know what, whatever, just kind of something like, just something I can find that inexpensive that I can maybe do something different with. So what I'd like to talk to you about a little bit today is what I, I, I really like to do is I, I, I get shopping bags now. You say shopping bags. What I do, and I got one here that I picked up the other day. Um, it's, a, it's, it's, a, it's a shopping bag. It's what it is. It's a shopping bag. It's a kind of picture of a flag. You know, you know what a shopping bag is. And I thought, well, 4th of July coming up, I might be able to do something with it. So we'll see. I got some ideas. But uh, how this all got started was when um, we were redoing my daughter's room. She had moved out or she'd been out for a while. But anyway, so we was making it into a guest room. And um, when one day we was out shopping and my, my wife was doing her thing, I was kind of looking at different stuff that I can find maybe to, to, to put in the room. And um, I come across the shopping bags and they're, they're like a buck a piece, you know. they. In this particular store we go to, they always have a bunch of them sitting up in the front of the store. And, you know, like for a dollar piece, and I just looked through them, and there was a couple that kind of spoke to me a little bit. I thought, well, you know, it was my daughter's room, so it, I'd seen a couple things. I thought, well, even though we're changing, it's not going to be pink anymore like it was when she was growing up. It's going to be a whole different room. But I still wanted to maybe do something to make me remember that was her room. So I got a couple bags and I did some things I made some pictures and I'll, I'll show you one of them right now um, I took one of the bags and I had some plywood and I took it let's see what we got here oh, upside down there we go I made this it's a picture I kind of hang it on the wall all I did was cut one side of the shopping bag out and I put it on a piece of plywood see you can look on the back here it's just plywood and there's one of the straps I use, I, I hang it up on the wall. So it was something that kind of reminded me of her a little bit. And so I did that and I'll show you what it looks like hanging on the wall. The thing about picking is you find stuff, at least for me, is I find stuff and I do something totally different with it or try to and hang it on the wall. And I get this, this in this case, I just hung it on the wall. And it's a piece that's unique to me and something that I like. Something reminds me, got a meaning to me, and I guess it won't really much matter if, you know, somebody else likes it or not, or I don't know. But it, it's, it talks to me and it's it's it, it just, just something a little different. So that's what we got here and that's what I did. That's my little quick tip today. And I, and I could think of all kinds of things to do with these shopping bags. And I'm gonna kinda, as I go along some of my other videos, I'll show you what I got in mind for this American flag that I showed you. And uh, I guess you get pretty extravagant with this stuff. You can you can mat it, do anything. It almost looks like a canvas, you know. So that's what I did, and I'll show you the. I'll go inside and videotape those ones inside and show you what I did, how they look on the wall. That's so. Here they are hanging on the wall. Um, this is the first one that I did. And the second one I'll show you here. Here we go. Got them hanging on each side of the window. Um, so that's what I did. That's all I got for you today. And I'll see you next time. I got a new video of Steel Yard Pickers that's gonna be coming out. It's episode two here in a, in a little bit. Maybe you'll watch that. Yeah, I think you'll like it. I think you'll like it. It's a little bit more picking than I did and some stuff I got. So that's my neighbor up there. He's, he's looking down on me, wondering who the hell I'm talking to, but who cares? That's all right. That's all right. Um, 
like I said, that was it. That's this episode. That's my little quick tip or whatever you want to call it. And remember, keep your eyes wide open. There's a treasure out there somewhere. Have a great day.